Principal Wells. Are you serious? I'm toast if he sees me. Nobody can expel me. Not yet, anyway. Oh boy. Look at me. Feeling sorry for myself when Kate Marsh's family is in mourning. They'll probably sue the Academy right out of Oregon. Now I understand why the students call this place Black Hell. Jesus. All right. He's drinking. I see that he's drinking. Well, let's go say hi to him and have a fucking chat since I can reverse time. That smart son of a bitch has me trapped. Hmm. Hi. Miss Caulfield, you have to be stealthier than that. You're not supposed to be outside your dormitory at this hour. You know that. He's I'm drunk. sorry, Principal Wells. I, I'm still upset about Kate. I needed some air and space to walk. I'm sorry you had to go through that today. You tried to help, but God damn it, Blackwell is my responsibility. And I I let her and Kate down. Jeez. He's go on hurting. back inside. Get some rest. It's been a shitty day. Good night, Max. Great. So how do I get past him to meet Chloe? First of all, go back. If I can. Okay. He's gotta go. There we go. I miss Caulfield. You have to Shit. be stealthier. Shit. Okay, I have to go all the way back. Okay. So I have to go all the way back. And then sneak up. I know I have a set of keys on me somewhere. Alright. I don't ah, see gotcha. anything. Max the ninja strikes again. All right. So that's how I did it. That's easy enough. Okay. Got to meet up with Chloe. All right. What what pictures do I need from here? Let me freeze the game. Okay. I was gonna say, let me freeze the game. Alright, fish. Smoking. Alright. Let's see. Oh my god! Holy Get it? fuck! Ooh, yeah. like I'm scared I hate you, Chloe. Holy like shit. Scary and sensitive asshole. <gasps> <laughs> Chloe, I watched my friend jump off a roof today. I don't think you need to prank me tonight. You always trip out on me for not being there for you, but is this how you're there for me? I'm... I'm sorry, Max. I, I wasn't even thinking. I suck. I'm not trying to be a bitch, but... I'll never get the image out of my head of Kate jumping off that roof. All because my power didn't work. It didn't mean shit. I know seeing Kate fall was horrible. I don't even know how to deal with that, so I just act like an idiot. But it's your badass power that's gonna bring all this to a close. We just need to connect the players. And find out who really killed Kate. We have to stop this from happening to anybody else. Oh yeah, and somehow stop that tornado from wiping out Arcadia Bay, right? Chaos theory. Didn't you say that it was all about chaos theory? I don't see any control over this chaos. Oh, right. Except for your ability to... Oh, yeah. Manipulate time and space? No biggie. Chloe, I just feel weird about some of my decisions. Especially after I just got Nathan expelled. Dude, do not even torture yourself like that. 
Let's focus on looking for clues, okay? Shit. Now I get to choose. All right, let's let's do Kate first. She's the priority. Right. For one thing, there's too much coincidence between the people around Kate and Rachel. Like Step Prick and Nathan Prescott? Not just them. Not just them. Yep. I just want to beat the shit out of those particular bros. I can still feel David's hand on my face. And even though I don't know her, it feels like Rachel is guiding us to the truth. Fuck the truth. I just want to find my friend right now. It scares me to think where she could be. Do you think she's... Dead? Dead? I'm sorry. I hate even saying that, Chloe. Not as much as I hate thinking it. Max, we have to find Rachel soon. We have to. I promise you we will. Like you said, it's time to start the search for clues. Now tell me what's your secret. Drum roll, please. I present the spare keys to Blackwell. Thank you, Step Prick. You are such a boss, Chloe. I just don't want you to get into any more trouble. Look at all the trouble dropping in Arcadia Bay. At this point, who gives a fuck anymore? We're in it to win it, Max. Lead the way. I'm so glad you're my partner in crime. As long as you're my partner in time. Insert groan here. Hmm. I love how they're just casually walking around campus like no one's watching them. Thank you again so much for helping me put together a portfolio. Hopefully the rest of the class will follow your lead. I'm sorry I was distracted. As you know, it's not been a good day for Blackwell. I know this has been an awful day and you can talk to me anytime, Mr. Jefferson. Thank you, Victoria. I imagine uh, you're pretty upset over Kate as well. The I'm like hell? still in shock. I've never seen anybody die. I really cared about Katie. Katie? I had no idea you two were that close. She wasn't. Did she? Well, how does this affect the Everyday Heroes contest? It doesn't. The contest is still a go, and I still have to pick the winner to best represent Blackwell. I've got all the photos, except one from Max. I'll give you a one-word sneak preview of Max's photo. Selfie. Listen, you've seen my entry. You know it's better than that. Wouldn't that be so cool to hang out together in San Francisco, Mark? Stick to Mr. Jefferson, oh, Victoria, please. my God, no way. And, uh, I haven't picked a winner yet. Oh, you my God. You love my work, so it's not like you're playing favorites. Just imagine if you picked my photo, though. We would have to spend a lot of time together. That could be fun, don't you think? I'm going to think that you didn't say any of that. You might as well choose me. Otherwise, I might have to tell people you offered to choose my photo for favors or something. As a favor to your future, I'll also ignore that undisguised threat. This conversation is officially over, Miss Chase. I suggest you go back to your dorm now. Wait! I only... Oh, are you dear fucking kidding me? Lord, is she trying to get in his pants? That is disgusting. It's so stupid. Just when I think Victoria can't get any more evil. Shit is about to get real at Blackwell. Let's go find out. Oh, that just gives me the frickin' heebie-jeebies. Chloe the Keymaster. You know it. Dude, I don't know about this. We're both already in so much trouble. You can always let me get busted like you did with the weed. I'm serious. We're not kids anymore. We're breaking and entering. If I have a key, how can it be breaking? I get charge us for just entering i'm serious we could go to jail not if i'm related to the head of blackwell security step shit will not want me in the hands of the local police so we better find out what's in the principal's office first you can rewind if we get caught right you have mad powers max this is true but tell that to kate and they may not work come on one more door and our work here is done and of course, Cooper decides right at the immediate moment to uh, want attention. Of course he does. 
Oh, he's cute. All right, I gotta focus. Okay. I don't want to walk too far. I'll just go in here first. Anything here? Anything of importance? Let's investigate. Anything important? Important? Nothing important. There's a door. That's the bathrooms. There's oh. Only a total phony would wear a crappy hat like that. That's unimportant to me. Alright. That's it. What the fuck? The security officer should have the key to the principal's office. Maybe he doesn't. He's hiding shit. Like everybody here. Well, now we definitely have to get this door open. Believe it or not, I know a little about lockpicking. Thanks to Frank. Hmm. I might as well test out my thief skill. Go for it. We're already in this deep. Well, you could look for the key. Just in case. Why, yes, I could. There's a thing of keys over here. I'll just casually walk over there and get a key. Search. Here are the keys. None for the principal's office. Shit. Is this lost and found? I feel bad for the twee hipster who lost this beret. I bet he's cute. Uh, search. Desolation. Alright, Cooper. He's rubbing all over me and moving my cords. Look. Squirrels like nuts. Does that mean Samuel is... Nah. <laughs> Alright. Uh, Nothing there? to see here. Just tacks and shit. Um, maybe these? desk no keys here thank you dirt bike that just rudely interrupted my concentration outside uh, fuck I don't see any did I miss anything? I don't think I did nothing up there to search nothing there to search oh there's drawers here Anything there? Boring. No key for thee. We have to find another way in. Guess I didn't spend enough time with Frank. But I'll use my DIY lockpick tools while you come up with a better plan. My plan has a name. Warren? Hey, Warren. Yep. You busy? Just bubble hearth. You'll be okay. Listen, I need your physics expertise stat. Without naming names, if somebody had access to the art and science labs and wanted to construct a device that would, say, open a locked door, would you maybe kind of know how? Huh? No. I'm just asking for fun. Oh, God. Thanks, science guy. Uh, no, no, no. Stay. We need you as backup. Just send the text instructions now. Yes, I'm still all in to go ape with you at the drive-in. Thanks for the help. Oh boy. This sucks ass. Goddamn door. Try not to wake up everybody at Blackwell. Sorry, Max. I got nothing. What about your plan? Sugar, soda, can, duct tape. I'm gonna tape. go put it together. Can you stay here and not get caught? I might get on the other side of that door before you, Lupin. The race is on. See you soon. Okay, so I need sugar. You, Cooper. Okay. All right. So, sugar, soda can, duct tape. I can get those first. All right. So, sugar. There's coffee stuff over here, so I could get sugar. Sugar. Ooh, sugar. That just magically disappeared. That's awesome. Okay. So now I need a soda more can. items to go. Soda can and duct tape. Warren is such a classic nerd. Let's see if I can find those items. Is there anybody here? I don't think so. I could get a soda can out of here. I could use this. Release the crack can. 
Alright. Take that. It's all mine anyway. Alright, now I need. You're halfway home, Max. Alright. Still there? Did you blow up? Max. Not yet. I need to concentrate now. Okay. Alright. So. I don't need to go into the bathroom. I need. Hmm. Well, I can go into the science room to get sodium chloride. That's for sure, as long as the door isn't locked. Open. Oh, it's not locked. That's a shocker. Gross. I hate that formalin smell. Alright. What's the exam file about up here? Only a B minus? Warren has shattered my faith. Of course, I'm barely passing science. Oh boy. Diagram. Um, graffiti. I never said they were great, troll. I had sex with your mom? Is that what that said on the side? Jesus. People are really cruel. Alright, I need... Look. So, sodium chloride is a weed killer. You'd think Warren would have told me that factoid. Okay, so it's weed killer. So does that mean I gotta go back out to Samuel's garage shed thingy and get sodium chloride? Maybe. Oh! Or it's just conveniently up here. Let's get that. Here's the sodium chloride box. It's a cigarette. Oh! Wait. W wait. Wait. Yes. Interesting. I got that one. Okay. Uh, so what was that? Okay. So I missed a fish tank somewhere. Who has a fish tank? I don't even remember who has a fish tank. I don't, I don't remember seeing a fish tank anywhere. Alright, so I gotta use the chair, right? To get that? Somehow? Right? Chair? Chair? Do I need a chair? Can I grab a chair? Come on, that's logic, right? I need the fucking chair. Can I... Do I have to- You know you're clumsy, Max. Don't waste your rewind power. Use the damn chair. Thank you, my god. Alright, got the weed killer. Now I need- Only One more ingredient left. Duct tape. Duct tape. Where can I find you? Maybe in Jefferson's? This is like a scene in a horror film. Alright. Let's look at the contest pictures. Let's take oh, a sneak through. Even when you were sad, you tried to see the good in the world. Shit. Victoria. That is pretty fucking sweet. How can I hate somebody that shoots like that? It looks like crap to me, but that's because it looks like it was done in MS Paint. Daniel's a better illustrator than photographer, <laughs> said Max, the art critic. Great. Right. So those are the pictures so far. Photo. I feel gross even looking at Nathan's work, but he does have some style. Interesting. Right. Cigarette pack. Victoria's cigarettes? <laughs> I'm sure Mr. Jefferson so she is smokes, impressed. huh? That's not a good thing to start doing when you're in high school. It's not a good thing in general, but you know. Is that 
Oh, duct tape! There's duct tape back here. Didn't think I'd find it in here, but I did. The tape is mine. All right, cool. Got all now the time to shit. Show Chloe that Max is the bomb. All right. Is there anything else? There's duct tape over here too. I could have got so much duct tape. Why is there so much duct tape? I can't run either. I can just walk a little faster. Alright. Now I can run. So that's just the other side. It's science. That door's closed. Let's go back in here and check this out. Here. Take it easy on the door, Chloe. Let's try this instead. Isn't it gonna oh, explode, make literally. a- Literally. Yes! Time to blow shit up! If you'll light the candle. This is so cool! Isn't it gonna make a noise? Get ready to haul ass. <laughs> that was so fucking cool! Everyone probably heard that. Oh, we are toast! Here comes the whole Arcadia Bay Fire and Police Department! Uh, so what should we do? Rewind. Rewind. <laughs> I don't want to get caught. Let's rewind. Alright. Let's, uh... Shit. Can I just find the key? Here are the keys. None for the principal's office. Isn't there another way? Is there a way to shut off the alarm? Or... I don't want to do that. I can't go back out. I can't search in here. Oh, these are just pillars. I'm thinking they're lockers or something. Poster, trophies, I can't go that way, can I go down here, no, no. A long time ago, Nathan got smacked down. Can't go in the men's room, obviously. What's that? Just posters. Alright. I guess there really isn't another way. Alright. I'm just gonna try to look around and see if there's any other way to get around exploding this fucking thing. Oh, I get to look in Kate's oh, locker. Kate, your locker looks so lonely. Alright, so that's... Still the science lab, I think? Is that the science lab? That's art class. Yeah, that is still part of the science lab. Can't go that way. <sighs> Fuck! Can I use my locker? That's Kate's locker. Alright. Nothing in these lockers. Nothing. Nothing. Posters. This is useless. Oh, fuck, man. Letter. There's no way David would get in Mrs. Grant's face. She'd shut his ass down fast. Oh, boy. Dear Miss Michelle Grant, as head of security at Blackwell Academy, it's my job and duty to make sure all the bases have been covered when it comes to protecting the student body. I know I'm not... 
I'm nobody's favorite among the faculty and students, but I know I'm making sure their safety is my prime directive. Since taking over as head of security, my statistics speak for themselves, as does the 15.4% drop in campus crime. I respect your position as a science teacher, but you have unfairly demonized my plans for surveillance system with a cowardly petition. I hope that you will redact this petition and consider the human cost of not retrofitting Blackwell Academy with the latest in safe and private security. Sincerely, David Madsen. Madsen. Ugh. Fuck you, David. I don't like you. I guess there's really no other way, or if there's another way, I kind of miss the opportunity. <sighs> Shit. Chloe. Okay. There's no other things. Wait. I guess we're doing this pipe bomb thing. There's no other choice. Take it easy on the. Alright. Fuck. What am I looking for exactly? There's right. only one way around this. L I fucked up. Am I still in here while time is reversed? I am. Door still locked. Get this bastard open. She can't cheat with her rewind. Oh, this is bullshit. Fuck you, door. Oh, that's clever. Welcome to my domain. You are magic. I have no clue how the hell you got in there, but you did it, sister. The company I keep. Now, let's find what we want and beat it. My powers only go so far. Yep. So now, now I can see why the principal locks this room up. Fancy faux art crap. He must want everybody to know he has money, but no taste. All right, let's look around. How can you trust somebody who has oh, a I fucking need a bronze of that. bird in his office? I'm glad I was expelled. Yes, if only the principal had a Monet or Picasso, you'd still be at Blackwell. Eat me. I'm gonna pill for the papers on this ugly ass desk. I need that picture. Turn around. Let me take it. Come on. Okay, sure. It's ugly, but damn, is it a cozy chair. This is your chance to truly get all deductive and shit, Sherlock. Find us some clues about Rachel, or Kate, or Nathan. Anybody. I'm on the case. Alright, turn around and get the picture. Come on. You're not so tacky up close. Can I... Uh, I need a picture of you somehow. I don't know how to do it. Um, let me check that text that I got. So did you blow the lock, Unabomber? Oh please, I just wanted to see if you knew your explosives and to see your incredible artwork. Smooth. Let's see what we got. That is so cool that my signature actually counted. Go, Miss Grant. Formula my petition to block the installation of a new surveillance system has received enough signatures for the school to re keep que something the plan. It is not my policy to take souls in these matters for the the Sweet. So I signed it and it worked. So, Nathan Prescott's dad is a bully, too. Oh, Shocker. boy. In light of the recent outrageous allegations against my son as a suspension, I feel that my large contributions to Blackwell Academy should also be suspended. Of course, the situation can be rectified. So basically, he's threatening to stop paying for the school because his son got expelled. Fucking asshole. All right. Let's search up here. 
Look at this pile. Okay. Did that mean you searched it? Tumbleweeds. Okay. Weird. This asshole has a spotless record. Hmm. I'm sure it's been, uh, tweaked. Like I'm not gonna read my own personal file. Hmm, Max, as she prefers to be called, is considered a quiet, quiet, attentive student with much potential. Her GPA fluctuates and she has acknowledged that she should be doing better. Her teachers back up her quiet intelligence, though some complaints find her too nervous and nosy. Some faculty members would like Max to speak up more in class and be more assertive. Others would like her to be less so, but it is common student suggestion rather than specific recommendation. Student transfer information. Update. Despite some recent confrontations, she tried to unsuccessfully stop fellow student Kate Marsh from jumping off the dormitory roof to her death today. At this time, there is ongoing police faculty investigation, but Max's bravery is undisputed. This file is going to be so spotless, a projectile vomit. Uh, gold standard. Student with consistently high GPA and extracurricular activities that reflect her career goals in photography. Also receives high marks from faculty for her devotion to the Vortex Club, among other organizations devoted to blacklist spirit in history. I have Fuck. to make sure Warren doesn't have a criminal background. He's considered an ex exemplary student and represents a long tradition of excellence in science and Blackwell, has the gift or curse of gab depending on the faculty. Some have accused him of playing science pranks, but this is not confirmed by a science teacher, Miss Grant. We hope Warren focuses his academic vision and continues toward his bright future. Huh. Well, good to know about us. Only two more files to go. Alright. Let's look through here. Rachel doesn't seem so troubled based on all this. But there's not much here about the police investigation. Uh, she excels in her studies. Um, she has a scholarship. Or qualities of scholarship and leadership. Include a career in international law and fashion modeling. Uh, Rachel Amber's investigation has been closed. Huh. We always hope that one magic clue, but once again, Arcady Bay covers up another secret. We always keep our eyes and ears open, but that's all we can do for now. She stopped attending class for the past month and left no contact with students or faculty. Her parents are at present unaware of her whereabouts. Damn. Man, I don't blame the principal for expelling Chloe. Oh, God. Bad Chloe's. <laughs> Problematic student. Uh, does little homework, often willfully belligerent to her teachers, caused numerous class disruptions with inappropriate comments and rude gestures, recently suspended for spray painting graffiti in the parking lot. Uh, she's intelligent with potential. She chooses to squander it on empty rebellion against non-mandatory institution. No longer a student. Expelled. Jeez. Poor Chloe. So there's Let's two. Let's nab this last file, Sherlock. Oh boy. Always wanted to say nab. I'd drink too if I was the principal of Blackwell. I think everybody would. And nothing here. All right. It's here. Wowzer. This will so not come in handy. I want a picture of this fucking bird. Okay. Okay. Maybe something down here? Maybe? No? No? Let's turn this lamp on. Kate's file. Ooh. This pretty much sums up Kate. Shy and sweet. And in the wrong place. <sighs> Consistently outstanding GPA. Optimistic attitude. Quiet work ethic. She does Meals on Wheels. Diverse religious studies group. She has the one best attendance records. Recent emotion, physical trauma. Dear God. Present time of security investigation. To a controver controversial video allegedly featuring Kate March. It's been uploaded to the internet without her knowledge or alleged consent. Damn. I 
think we found everything in here. I should go join Chloe now. Did we just completely, we just completely took that. <laughs> That's not going to be obvious or anything, right? Max, you better come check out these files. Uh-oh. Nathan accuses Rachel of bringing drugs on campus. Uh-oh. And my step troll went along because he thinks Rachel was a bad influence on me. Oh, God. Assholes. If David is teaming up with Nathan Prescott, that's a bad sign. Nathan Prescott III. Ooh, he's so money. And you know the Prescotts dropped major bank to bury Nathan's real file. Look, it reads like a rap sheet. Bad grades, teacher complaints, secret probation. But I was expelled? At least Nathan was finally suspended. Check out that note. Open it. It's just some crazy drawing. It's not a drawing. Look. Rachel in the dark room. Rachel in the dark room. Over and over. That's it. That's fucked up. What does this even mean? Nathan is truly psychotic. I know he has something to do with Rachel missing. Probably. Oh, listen to this. David M. always asks what's going on in my head. David M. always helps me follow those he follows. <laughs> it's pretty cryptic. No, it sounds like they formed some sort of weird team, the Super Hebros. Jesus. David was stalking Kate, hassling me, and now we know he was all over Rachel, too. Oh, we are so going into his garage files. Plus, I'm getting a little paranoid in here. We got our info. Let's bail. But maybe we shouldn't leave without a gift. No, you are not taking the cozy chair. Max, do your powers include mind reading? Or did you just rewind because I tried to steal the chair? <laughs> Shit, I'm confused. It's the powers of best friendship. I know how you roll. We should definitely get out of here. We pressed our luck enough. Hello, what have we here? Mm. Holy shit! Jackpot! Cha-ching! Wow, sir. That's a lot for the handicapped fund. Dude, there's $5,000 here. I could pay Frank back tonight. This'll chill him out after our knife showdown yesterday. Are you gonna make a big issue out of this? Or just rewind and take the greenbacks for yourself? Oh god. I hope you do that instead of lecturing me. Ugh. Leave the money. We're already in enough trouble. You really want to take money from the handicapped fund? I know you need to pay Frank back, but... I've got my power to protect you, right? There's a lot of power in that horse-choking wad of cash. But yes, Moral Max is right again. I guess. Let's get the hell out of this office, Morg. Alright, let's sit in the chair and take a picture of the bird. Please? I know that money would have helped Chloe and me. My god. Oh, he disrupted class, crude outburst. Oh man. This is creepy. Throwing a desk in class, cursing at his English teacher, lighting firecrackers in the bathroom, stealing school supplies, threatening the school custodian, attempted theft of campus, to bang a statue. Oh my god. Uh. Drug mule. Oh my god. What a fucking liar! What a fucking liar! You're not so tacky up close. Can I? I want to take a picture of you. I know I have to take a picture of you somehow. I just don't know how. Pretty sure it's you. Pretty sure. Does that not look like a hawk in the bottom corner? Like, come on. It has to be. Whatever. Maybe I missed my opportunity at some point. I don't know. Okay. Let's leave. That impish look scares me. Care for a midnight swim? The Blackwell pool is ours. Swimming? Hell yeah. You want to take that risk now? It's been a cray week. 
You didn't let me take that money to pay off Frank, so if he pops a cap in my skull, at least allow me to have a little carefree fun for a few minutes. Splish Splash? You're right. We hella deserve it. Splish Splash. Did you actually just say hella? Huh? I think I'm a good bad influence on you. <laughs> a good bad influence. 